Ian Douglas here on the eve of St. Valentine's Day Massacre. We've just weighed in. Better watch out because he's a war machine. Ray Rochelo, what are your impressions going into tomorrow's heavyweight title fight with those? I feel great. Um, been training hard. Got a nice couple. Got a nice break the last couple of days. So I uh, feel well rested, prepared. I can fight right now. Fight last week. Fight tomorrow. So we'll be ready for it. Do you have quite the group of people that's going to be accompanying you to this fight tomorrow? Is that right? Yeah, we got a couple mud dogs, Wayne State boys. Um, everybody from the uh, Detroit Beach Mafia. We'll have all the all the guys from the old school there. So uh, we should have a good time. So. I don't know if I asked you this before, if I already did earlier, please forgive me, but is there any special pressure you feel representing a university in this fight? Uh, absolutely. I mean, I feel a lot of pressure from everywhere. I just bought a limo so uh, for tomorrow night, so I can't, can't really go home without a belt in this limo. So, I mean, I'm here, I'm here to show my friends a good time, and you know, that's exactly what we're going to do. Limousine riding, jet flying. They were going to call it the curse of Ric Flair if you don't come <laughs> home with a belt tomorrow. <laughs> Woo! That's exactly what we wanted to hear. Well, good luck, good luck tomorrow, and I hope to talk with you later on after the show. Absolutely. I appreciate it. Thanks a lot.